Yeah. Yes, Mel. All right, new person. Let's take. The ferrets, lizards, pigeons, snakes, fox, and falcons. Well, they discovered me really quick, which means we are. Must be next to the neighbors. Oh, they're up there. Oh, they got a nice pocket expand. I guess I do too. This is a very odd map. It's a campfire. I wonder if I should take that. I'll think about it later. Alright, we need to see what they're doing. Oh, they're going greedy. Full greed. Let's try and punish that then. See if we can get some wizards and do some harass on that. Two wizards won't be enough. We at least four should do the trick. Oh boy. Not with machine guns, it won't do the trick. Okay, so you're going defensive. That's fine. That's fine, we can deal with that. Alright, you can see if they're expanding. And if not, we go pigeons and ferrets. Pigeons for the sight, and then ferrets for the anti-machine guns. And... Alright, I'll we'll put my army back here and I'm going to suicide in their base and try and see what they're doing. Do you have a lot of... Little... We'll put out a snake in case they're gonna go for like quick tier three or something. Then we might have something to deal with that. Oh, that is a lot of squirrels. That is a lot of squirrels. I do not have the army composition to deal with that many squirrels. Not until my snakes get out. So if I can tag them with my snake, they will all eventually die. Oh, I don't have any wizards. That's not good. I'm not prepared for a squirrel ball. Okay, snakes. Snakes. Kept us alive. Ah, it's more squirrel ball. I didn't realize a squirrel ball is like good. Can I tag enough of them to survive? No. Okay, I, I need to kill the snake because as good as that is, I need the food more so I can build the lizards. Oil ball, that was not 
not what I was expecting. Fortunately, when you're all MG'd up like that, that the only way I win this is if I can somehow expand while they're doing whatever and get out more eco. So otherwise they're gonna attack with mass squirrels and I'm just going to lose and that might be right here right now. Not able to scout because of the defensive breaks in the MGs, so well played to them. Yep, that's good. Try the boar. Try the lizard squirrel. I don't have an expansion period. Okay. So, without a good expansion that I can defend, I mean, I guess I have this. They can't get to me, so maybe I don't have to go all in. I mean, it definitely feels like I need to do an all-in. They have this pocket expand over here. I'll try and see if the mole squirrel timing still works. Yeah, mole squirrel timing. We'll try that. 9 or 12 squirrels, and then some moles to tank, and then just charge straight in. I wonder if that still works in the new patch. I'll find out. Is that the plan of action? Now, are they going squirrels or are they going lizards? Lizards. That's not good. Now we'll go squirrel lizard mole timing, see if that's the weapon. The nice thing about moles is they can be built anywhere. They're the only unit that can be built anywhere. Alright, moles to tank. Wizards and squirrels to do damage. Alright, here we go. Looks like it's working. I kill pigs. And now I need to pull back before I overextend myself. And then let's expand so we can heal near here. There's another mole for tanking. Yeah, I think we'll beat them on the economy front that we did enough damage. And then we'll slowly heal in our territory. Yeah. 
Yeah, they're rebuilding the farms. We just save up for some ferrets and bomb them. That sounds like a good idea. We'll just shoot them and force them to attack in that press is the idea once the ferrets come out. I mean, we're ahead right now, so when you're ahead, get more ahead. I just need to make sure that I have enough DPS here. And it looks like I just barely do. Just barely. Maybe we'll see with the... Yep. Um, I think I saw the developers are thinking about some DLC units already. So that's kind of cool. Something to look forward to. <laughs> yeah, we'll go with the wolf again. But yeah, it's it's uh, another one of those active but small RTSs, like most RTS not named StarCraft. I mean, RTS that are big, for the exception, like uh, Age of Empires 2 or Company Heroes 2, and most RTSs are just always going to be smaller. That's just the nature of the genre these days. It's a lot easier to get the RTS feel in a MOBA. But the nice thing about this one is it's actually pretty accessible. I mean, I'm playing with a gamepad right now. And while I'm talking, I'm off on my timings. So that's not the best, but... Okay, they're only getting their first born up also, so with the defender's advantage, that won't be too bad. I'll go greedy, go for another farm. What do we have? Squirrels. Where, what else are you doing because you have less income than me? Yeah, it's pretty good. I'd say it's definitely one of the more innovative RTSs in a while. That an awful trading company. So there's no... So there's only one farm, I mean campfire on this map. Alright, let's go for that mixed wizard squirrel force. Let's try and figure out what they're doing. Lots of squirrels. Like, do they have like a pocket expand out? What are they doing with all their money? That's my question. That was a bad. That was poor on my part. They're just squirrel balling. I need to fight in my warrens so the warrens tank. Okay, that was a super sloppy on my part. Let's actually put the warren over here so it'll live. I do have. The one economic advantage over them. And they're not here to micro. Ah, I don't have enough. I should have enough. Wait for a couple more to come out. 
Oh, you're building a balloon? That's why I don't have enough. This balloon's killing me. Oh, that's... that's so rude. Um... I don't know what actually kills balloons. That was... Yeah, because I can't build these small units because the balloon is going to like one-shot them. And that's game over. I hit surrender. Okay. Also, building that mole up where the front would have been was a bad idea. I didn't realize that was going to be the front line. Did I bring skunks that time? I don't remember. I think to beat the balloons, you're just supposed to overwhelm them with, like, cheap tier 1 infantry or something? Because they only can shoot so fast, but... That doesn't seem like a very effective... So that was a very... Easy to defend-ish, but easy to attack. Expansion, and then expansion up top. Where are you? I step on my timing a little bit. Okay, so you're going heavy eco. Opening, that means I can come back and put down safely two more farms and then go the wizards. What's a fact? See what's here in the middle. Okay, they have a campfire. I don't have a campfire. They have an easy defendable pocket expand. And they're not doing anything with their money. Which worries me. Okay, well I do have that expansion over there. Two expansions to my right. Ah, you're just going mass squirrel. Well, there's a way to deal with that, and that's called skunks, and I'll be able to afford skunk very soon. And I'll put my guys up top, so I have the sight advantage. And this battle starts, hopefully. And we wait for the skunk to come. And then let's expand so we can heal. Alright, one skunk is coming out. Start. So we're squirrels, two farms, and what are you doing? For a ball. Expanding and going into two tier twos. And you took a farm. Okay. So if I can get the skunk up here, this might be a timing attack. At least kill this. And force. Falcons. Okay. We can deal with Falcons. Just gotta build. Yeah, skunks are pretty good at dealing with squirrels, and I need not to bring my lizards out in the open like that. And 
and we build some moles for tanking, and then we just try and go straight up the middle. This or Stardew Valley. Well, those are two completely different genres. I have not played Stardew Valley, Valley, so I can't. Can't. Uh, don't know how good it is. Now don't fight in the gas. They went too much onto the farms, it looks like. Eco, that is. No, kill the falcon. Oh, I don't have my skunks. Okay, I need to pull back before I overextend. And then I also need to finish expanding. Fall on the head. Build another skunk warren. Oh, I can't. I only have one skunk, I really would rather wait till I have more skunks to attack. Um, also, I wonder if I should go for the wolf. That wouldn't be a bad idea. Now I have... Oh. Superpower my attacks. Have the economic advantage. I should anyway. Build a bunch of moles for tanking. And by tanking, I mean killing the Zemgenus. Then I do need to get what my get enough food so my wolf will come out. So once the wolf starts building, I'll expand to the farm the farms behind me. A bunch of moles for the MGs. I think balls in an army is still viable. They're still pretty tanky, and I do double X crit to structures. The wolf's almost up. That is a lot of falcons. But I think I have enough pure squirrel DPS to deal with it. And now I should have enough moles that this isn't a problem. Yeah, with this wolf, this should be pretty easy. 